Hey y'all, happy Monday, happy Messy Movement Monday. I hope that you all are feeling well and um, that you're coming into this week with a sense of renewal and a sense of hope, uh, rest, ease, all the things that would make this week um, just that more, much more fulfilling. Um, I'm a little nervous because I haven't done these in a while, but I'm like, I really want to talk more with you all, hear more about, you know, how you're feeling in the process of like connecting to your body and finding and discovering what feels righteous about your sensuality and how you want to embody that. And so I wanted to start with, um, just an opportunity for us today to do a little bit of breathing together to set some intentions for this week. Uh, we may get a few, you know, just a few little tilts and <laughs> stretches in there. Um, but the whole point is just for you to have take a moment today um, to connect with yourself. So I hope that you enjoy. Uh, we won't have any music uh, in this first session. So I really want you to tune into the sounds that are around you if they are pleasant. And if not, I just want you to focus on the sound of your own breath as we're doing the exercise. So I want you to go ahead and take a deep breath in. You don't have to close your eyes just yet. You can take in what's in your space and just take in this moment like where you are right now. Notice what sounds stick out to you most. You don't have to do anything too exaggerated with your breath, but I just want you to just listen for where it's at right now. Do you feel yourself tightening in certain places? Do you feel your breath skipping? Do you feel your heart rate in a consistent pattern? Just notice what's happening in the body. Now this time I want you to take a deep breath in through the nose and I want you to exhale through the mouth, just letting the jaw hang naturally, not forcing too much sound out. Take a deep breath in and exhale. And take a deep breath in and exhale. One more time, deep breath in. And let the jaw come down, really light. And exhale. And I want you to take a deep breath in. This time, I want you to feel your chest rise up, feeling the air coming into the upper part of the body. Take a full deep breath in. And exhale like a little kid. <sighs> you know how kids, when they're done with something, they're just like, oh, all right, <laughs> that's that's over. <laughs> Take that deep breath a couple times. <sighs> what are you done with this week? <sighs> Thinking about all the things that you moved through last week. What are you putting down this week? Inhale in again. Feel your spine start to shift into a like a straight line. And we're pulling up all the way through the crown of the head, feeling that elongation. 
feeling that pull in the, the base of the stomach all the way down at the bottom of the spine and pulling all the way up, feeling your string pull all the way up. And I want you to take a deep breath in this time and I want you to exhale and let the breath go. Ha! Ah, like you just like came into like the brightest new day ever, right? Like you're like, this is gonna be amazing. So I want you to I want you to let that breath go in that really open and expressive way. So pulling your string all the way up. Inhale in, pull up, 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 and exhale. Ha! Ah, pushing it all the way out. And again, inhale in, pull up, 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 up with that string. And exhale, ha! And inhale in one last time. And pulling all the way up with your string. And letting that breath go out into the world. Ha! I want you to take a deep breath in and bring your hands to your stomach. And just rocking back and forth. Find a place that feels comfortable. So maybe you need to go a little bit slower, or a little bit faster with your rock, but just find that space where you feel like you're really cradling your body. And I want you to try to feel the belly as you inhale and exhale. Just letting the breath out, no sound. Inhale in, feel the belly. And exhale, no sound. Inhale in, feel the belly. And exhale, no sound. Last time, inhale in, fill the belly as much as you can, and exhale. Now go ahead and take your chin to your chest. Still feeling that elongation in the spine. You really want to kind of feel your neck tilt up and over, not just straight down. You don't want to cut off your breathing. You do want to lift your chest, feel that openness, feel that elongation in your spine, and then pull the head down. Feel that really tender stretch in the sides here. And let that go. And come all the way down again, bringing the chin to the chest. And we're just going to take a couple circles on each side. Let's just do two circles each side. Slowly pulling the neck around. And again. Feeling the elongation on each side, knowing there's no rush. And switch directions. And last time. Coming back to center. Let's go back to that rock. We're going to reverse ourselves as much as we can. Let's see if we can remember what we've done. 
So we did some rocks here, taking that deep breath in, filling the belly and exhale. No sound. Inhale in, fill the belly, exhale. No sound. And pull the spine all the way up towards the ceiling. Feeling that stretch and that elongation. Inhale in, fill the chest and express it out to the world. Ha! Ah, letting the chest open. And again, pull all the way up. Pulling the spine up and exhale. Ha! Ah, and back to our little kid breath, right? Like that intention of what are we, you know, when kids are done with something, they are done with it. So what are you putting down this week? What are you done with this week? And you may have to put it down a couple times. That's fine, you know. Um, our, our brains all work in very unique ways. So don't worry if you can't put it down right in this moment, but just hold that intention this week of, okay, well, last week I said I, w I dealt with this, but you know, I said I made a, a commitment to myself that this week we were done with that. So whatever that is for you, um, this like embody that breath, embody that energy as you do this last breath, take that deep breath in and ha just let it go just like little kids do just like flopping it down done with it inhale in and exhale ha and one more time inhale in and exhale ha that felt kind of final <laughs> And down to our final breath that we started with is just a relaxed um, inhalation and letting the jaw hang. Um, no sound, no no um, need to be as expressive, but just let the, the breath fall in and out of the body. Inhale in and exhale. Inhale in and exhale and last time inhale in and exhale i hope that you all enjoyed that i hope that that felt good to your bodies i know sometimes like when you got a lot of things going on things are stressful or life is going on and you know you're running from here to there it can be really hard to you know, one, prioritize having a moment to pause um, because, you know, a lot of times we're operating in survival mode and we're just trying to get things done and to get through the day and to feel like we actually got something done at the end of the day. Um, but, you know, giving ourselves, the more that we work the muscle, the more that we uh, make the space, even just one to five minutes at a time, the more the easier it becomes to choose to pour into the tank versus to keep ignoring it and so you know we're all in practice together you know y'all know like i've been sharing with you all the journey that you know our family is on and you know how things have you know can get just they can rock you um at any given moment and um you know you have to be willing to just take a pause and um, to be able to reset and restore in the ways that you can so that you can keep going and so that you can keep doing your work in the world. I hope that you all enjoyed this and I'd love to invite you to come to class with me. Um, we're doing our intro class, How to Awaken Your Sensual Self. And this is how we start class. So if you've ever been worried about how to receive the sensual movement classes start off, <laughs> I promise you we're not dropping into headstands and splits at the beginning of class. Um, we do start with, you know, kind of checking in with our bodies and seeing and evaluating where that relationship is even at with our bodies, with our sensuality, and then easing into movement from there um, that is regenerative and um, helps you feel uh, more connected and more at ease um, with your body where you are right now. Uh, so I'd love to have you all join me. The link is in my bio, um, and I'll also share the link in my stories as well. Um, the class is uh, on Sunday 
and then if you're not able to make the class you'll also get the recording or you can just purchase the recording to the class uh, so i'm looking forward to connecting with y'all vibing with y'all seeing some familiar and new faces and of course if you all have any questions at all please don't hesitate to hit me up all right y'all happy monday bye